I am Alice and I will be looking at an image from the Qing Dynasty for the multimedia presentation of page 2031. This image from the reading is a silk tapestry titled Evening in the Peach and Plum Garden. Upon further research, the artist Leng Mei was a court painter during the reigns of Kangxi to Qianlong emperors who excelled at painting figures and court scenery. The scene was a creative recreation of Li Bai's preface to the banquet at the Peach and Plum Garden on a spring evening. Li Bai was a famous Chinese poet during the Chang Dynasty, where Chinese poetry was flourishing. From this, we can infer the man white with the blue head wrap and has a brush in his hand is Li Bai composing poetry as he and other scholars drink together. Unlike Li Bai, the scholars preferred enjoying themselves as they were drinking in a laid-back posture, and two of the men were gladly receiving wine from a courtesan. Their writing materials were untouched and on the floor, suggesting pleasure was more important to them. On the left side of the painting, a man in garments less grand than the scholars suggests he is a servant sneaking a sip of wine as the one besides is looking out for him. The difference in garments show a clear class difference, but also we can infer this from the way they drink alcohol. The scholars are probably receiving a drink with tongues, but the servant is stealing a sip. Alcohol is an expensive commodity during the Tang Dynasty, therefore scholars of the higher class could lavishly enjoy alcohol, but servants in the lower class could not. As previously mentioned, the image is based on Li Bai's preface, Hu Tian Di Zhe. Wan Mu Zi Ni, Li Guan Ni Zhe, Bai Dai Zi, Guo Ke Er Fu, Sheng Ruo Meng, Wei Huan Ji. Which loosely translates to the husband of heaven and earth, the reverse of all things, the travel of time, of hundreds of generations, the passing gas and floating, life is like a dream, for the sake of happiness. As such, this image represents Li Bai's preface quite accurately as it shows the joy of a banquet, but also a representative of the thriving world of Chinese literature, drinking as a social pleasure, and the economical rise of alcohol. Thank you.